Okay, uh, this is it. Chapter 2, uh, Principles of Money Time Relationships. Parang, kanya, no? parang relasyon, ano? Money and time. Bakit kaya laging magkasama ang money at saka time? ba? Diba? Tayo nga mismo, kung habang tayo nabubuhay, lagi, na, lagi natin tinatang sarili natin. Nung, ano, yung nung kabataan natin, ganun, nung nag-aaral tayo, nung uh, pag nakatapos na tayo, ang tinatanong natin, kailan? Ano, kailan kaya ako magkakaroon ng trabaho? Kailan kaya ako kikita? Ano, kailan nga kaya ako mag-umpis ang magnegosyo? Ano, no, time, ano, kailan? Ano kayong gagawin ko? Ano, para magkaroon ako ng profit or income, o, di ba? O, kailangan, time, ano, is uh, related to time, yung money. O, chapter 2. Okay, the objective of this chapter is to provide an understanding of the return to capital in the form of interest or profit. And to illustrate how basic equivalence calculations are made with respect to the cost of capital in engineering economic studies. So, di ba? Yung return of capital kaagad, di ba? Pag nag-invest ka, nagpa-utang ka, ano kaagad yung nasa isip mo? Return, ano? Kailan? Ano ako kikita, ano? Pag nag-invest ka, pag nag-negosyo ako, magkano kaya yung kikitain ko? Magkano kaya yung kikitain ko after one month? Magkano kaya kikitain ko uh, daily? Ano, di ba? Yun yung kagad na nasa isip natin. Yung return of capital. So, this capital... Uh, is in the form of money and property, ano, capital. Ang puhunan, hindi lang siya pera pala, no? pwede rin property, o, oh. wala kang pera, pero meron kang property, pwede mo siyang <clears throat> iparent, ano, o kaya list, list ang tawag na, no? list, parent, ano? to produce more wealth, sabi niya. Para kumita ka, alimbawa, meron kang tricycle, meron kang, <clears throat> lupa sa tabi ng highway. O, pwede mo nga i-parent yun. Ano? Kaya meron kang building, meron kang bahay, o kaya ka bahay lang, meron kang bahay na hindi natitirhan, natin, hindi tinitirhan. Pwede mo i-parent yun as uh, boarding house or apartment. Ano? Para kumita ka ng pera. Ano? Ano? Okay? So, money uh, involves time. Hindi siya basta may mga pera ka na, kikita ka na. Dapat mong i-invest din. And it takes time, ano, hindi lang, nag-invest ka ngayon, bukas meron ka ng profit, hindi, ano. It takes time, siguro, one month, ganun. Wala namang, nagpautang ka kayo, bukas meron ka ng profit, meron ka na, magbabayad na kagad yung pinautang, hindi, ano. So, it takes time. Okay. Next, so, sabi nga, yun nga, kapital, Ah, uh, meron tayong dalawang category, yung equity and yung debt or borrowed capital. Equity ito yung mismong pera mo na pag-aari mo no. <clears throat> pag-aari ng isang individual no? owned by the individual so have invested their property in a business project or venture in the hope of receiving a profit ano. <clears throat> So, yun, yung pera. Kung may pera ka, ano, sino kaya sa atin ng walang utang? Sarili yung pera. Or, ikaw naman yung umutang, ano, you know, debt capital or often called borrowed capital, ano, term na borrowed, ano yun, inutang, ano, obtained from lenders, ano, for investment. So, ano yung mga, ano, yung mga reason, the return of cap to capital in the form of interest and profit is an essential ingredient. In studying engineering economy with the following reason. Ano? So, in interest and profit pay the providers of capital for foregoing use during the time capital is being used. Ano? So, yung interest at saka profit, ito yung parang uh, reward ano? yung sa pag-invest mo. Ano? Ito yung pro na provide sa iyo. <clears throat> paggamit ng yung capital ano okay interest and profit are payments for the risk the investor takes in permitting another person 
or an organization to use his or her capital or risk parang sugal ba you know, di ba di ba maraming babalitaan is scam ano nagris kasi yung tao nag-invest siya ba nagbigay siya ng 500,000 100,000 sabi no pare meron tayong investment and dito project invest ka kikita ka kita ka nang ito malaki yung 100,000 makikita ng 300,000 walang ganoon ano it takes time so risky ano ikaw naman gusto mong kumita kaagad ng pera ininvest mo kaagad ano So, mali yun, ano uh, Dapat pag-isipan mo rin. Mayroon dapat kasunduhan. Ano. So, risky siya. Ano. Hindi mo alam na yung negosyo malulugi. Ano. Ano, malulugi siya, mawawala. Ayun, ano. So, risk. Inarbit mo yung tao na gamitin yung pera mo. Ano. Yun. Okay? O, time value of money. Okay? Sabi nga nila, money makes money, di ba? Pag nag-invest ka, nag-negosyo ka, kikita ka, magkaroon ka ng pera. The time value of money explains the change in the amount of money over time. Ano? Yung change, pag-change ng money over time. Nag-invest ka ng 1,000, after a month, nagiging 1,000. So, nagkaroon ka ng change in amount. Ano? Depende yon sa point of view. kung invest or humira ano Okay Ah uh, no ulit lang ano so Sabi nga this is true because if you invest money today nag deposit ka design na product or bumili ka ng machine para ben uh, ipa ano mo gamitin mo sa ibang Um, bagay para kumita ng pera sabi nga nila by tomorrow mag- magkakaroon ka na ng mas maraming pera accumulated more money ano. limbawa yun nga sa, parang sa atin meron kang pera bumili ka ng combined harvester yun kumikita yun investment yun ah, seasonal yun ano, twice a week uh, twice a week twice a year kang kikita ano Diba, dito sa atin, twice a year tayong mag-harvest, o twice a year ka rin kikita. May uh, semi-annually, ano yun. Yun. Okay? Okay? Uh, uh, then, uh, interest. Uh, ito na yung lagi nating uh, iniisip palagi. Ano? Lalo na yung mga nagpapautang. Interest is the manifestation of the time value of money. Ano? Uy, kumita ako. Uy, may increase yung pera ko. Lalo na sa mga nagpapotang 5-6, di ba? Weeklyan silang naniningil o kaya daily. So, ano yung target nila doon? Kumita, ano? magkaroon ng interest yung kanilang pera. Para bang umikot sa minang roll, nagro-roll siya. So, compute, uh, computationally, oh, di ba? interest is the difference between the ending amount of money and the beginning amount of money. Ito yung principal, yung starting amount, halimbawa 1,000, saka yung ending amount, 1,000. Halimbawa, nagpotang ka ngayon, 1,000 yung principal. Pag naningin ka in the future, 1,000. So, yung interest nyo is 200. The difference. Yan lang, ano? Wala naman sigurong negative, ano? Or zero. Pag nagpotang ka, hindi ka na makakasingil. Yun ang negative siguro, ano? So, there are always two perspectives to an amount of interest. Interest paid and interest earned. Paid, siguro, yung, ha, yung uh, nagbayad ka, earned, ito naman yung pagbinayaran ka. Ano. Okay? So, the original amount, ang tawag doon is principal amount. Yung pinakutang mo. Okay, ito nga, yung sinabi ko kanina, Uh, <clears throat> depende yun sa perspective, no? sa point of view ng tao, sa borrower at investor or lender. Pag ikaw ang borrower, yun nga, umutang ka sa banko, mo to, yung banko ang magbibigay sa'yo. Yan. And the end of a year, or repayment period, magbabayad ka na. Mag- with interest, ano? plus interest. 
or ito naman pag ikaw naman may pera meron kang mil, meron kang marami kang pera meron kang pera ano mag-invest lang sa isang company corporation halimbawa sa hospital yung sa MMG daw kung meron kang pera halimbawa 200,000 invest mo siya for construction siguro ng hospital nila kasi yun gawin pa lang construction at the end of ano, time pag kumikita na yung hospital o ano ano No invest mo, meron kang ano, uh, dividend ng tawag doon ano. Magkakaroon ng interest yung pera mo ano. Yung corporation naman ngayon ang magbabayad sa iyo. Ayun, depende yan, ano. Next. Ano naman ang interest rate? Ito yung percentage ano, halimbawa ah, sa mga bombay daw 20% ata. Yung 10,000 magiging 12,000. 20% ano, laki ano. Laki ng interest, ano, yung interest rate, ano, 20%. So, interest rate is the equal, yung I, ah, ay na maliit, ano, interest rate. Iba, ba, iba naman yung ay na malaki. Ay na malaki is the amount. Interest rate is the percentage, you know. And interest rate is equal to the interest accumulated. Halimbawa, yung 10,000, na yung mo sa Mumbai, principal 10,000, Naging 12,000 siya after 3 months. So, yung 12,000, 2,000 yung interest doon. Ano, yung amount niya. So, 2,000 uh, divided by 10,000 is equal to a times multiplied by 100%. 100 equal to 20%. Ano, yun. Saka depende rin yan sa usapan. Ano, kung monthly, weekly, ang bayaran. Ano, monthly, weekly, yearly. Semi-monthly or quarterly. Okay. Dito na tayo. Interest formula sa Nico Balance. Ito yung simple interest number one. Pinaka-simple ito. Ano. Simple interest. Bakit? Kasi yung fixed percentage of the principal multiplied by the life of the loan. Yun nga. O fixed percentage. Yung simple interest is equal to principal amount. Dito. P. Multiplied the N. Multiplied the ay, o ano. O, oh, yun nga. Limbawa, yung 10,000, fix na yun. Yung 10,000, pag umutang ka sa Bombay, 2,000 ka agad yung interest doon. Yung 2,000 na yun, yun ang fixed inter- ano, niya, interest niya. Ano. Hindi na mag-interest yung 2,000. Sa 3 months mo na babayaran. Ano. Hindi ka gaya sa compounding, yung 2,000, mag-interest pa yun. Limbawa, yung 2,000 magiging 220, 2,200, ganun, 2,300, ganun. Pero dito, fix. Fix din yung interest rate. Fix yung uh, year, ano. Yung life. Oh, multiplied by the life of the loan. Yung gano'n yung katagal mo bayaran. So, interest. Okay? So, future is equal to P plus I. So, makikita nyo dun sa computation ko. Sa video ko. Ipa-plug in ko na lang dito. Ano? And then... Uh, yung mga solution ng mga problem dito, <clears throat> siguro, so solve ko to, ipicturean ko, tapos send ko ulit sa ano natin, messenger sa ka Facebook natin. Okay? So, uh, please, uh, kung meron man medyo ma- mahina sa sounds, uh, mag-headset na lang pang, you know, dinownload pa o kaya pinanood ito ang video ko. And play, please like and share my Facebook page, Sir Agri. Bye-bye! Okay. Okay. Kakampit lang natin yung apat siguro or tatlo na uh, problem. Sa so, problem sa so, number one. So, an employee at laserkinetics.com borrows 10,000 on May 1 and must repay a total of 10,700 exactly one year later. Determine the interest amount and the interest rate interest pay rate pay. Number one, given. Kung ano yung yan, so madaling na siya. Principal is 10,000. Future amount is 10,000. Magbabay din ng 10,000. So what is the interest paid? Ano? So interest is equal to F minus P. Ano? So 10,000. So interest is 700 pesos. Ano? Now, magkano yung ano, 
il mio interesse. So, interest rate, so ay na maliit na. So ay na malaki is the amount. Na. So ay na maliit is the interest rate in percent. So interest rate is the interest amount paid divided by the principal. So the principal natin is 10,000 multiplied by 100. So interest is 7% for sure. 7%. So number two. Stereophonics interpreted plans to borrow 20,000 from a bank for one year at 9% interest rate interest for new recording equipment. Compute the interest and the total amount due after one year. So, given. So, mirang daw sila. Mirang na 20,000 principal. At 9% interest rate. So, I is 9%. And I thought, compute the amount of interest and the amount, total amount. So I is unknown, F is unknown. So what do we need? So solution. So I is equal to P and I. One year, that one, for one year. So N is one, for I am N. One year. Okay, so twenty thousand multiplied by one one year multiplied the interest rate of nine percent so point zero nine. So the interest is interest amount. I miss point zero nine is equal to one eight and one eight. So one eight to interest over. So look at your principal. Yeah. F is equal to of course twenty thousand plus one eight. Twenty thousand eight hundred. Or F uh, P N Now, number 3 What is the future worth of 1,000 invested at 6% simple interest worth uh, 10 of years Okay, number 4 Madali na number 3 Kaya na bala doon Last year Gaming's grandmother offered to put enough money into a savings account to generate 5,000 interest this year. Health pages, expenses at college. Okay, number four. Medyo... Medyo lang. Ay, na-complicated. Ano na yung pindihan nyo ha? Tumagot naman kayo. Okay. Walang sumagot. Okay, naintindihan siguro. Number four. Last year, Jane's grandmother offered to put enough money into a savings account to generate 5,000 in interest. 5,000 dollars in interest. Interest is 5,000 This year to help pay Jane's expenses at college Calculate the amount that had to be deposited Exactly one year ago To earn 5,000 interest Now At the rate of return 6% Per year 6% interest And the principal amount So principal So And then formula then I is equal to P and I. So N is one year. So I is 5,000 divided by 
n is 1, 1, 0, 6. So, siguro 30,000 yan. Ay, no, no. 83,000. So, si Lola, kailangan niya ng mag-deposit na 83,333 para makapag-earn siya ng 5,000 na interest rate. Okay? There's a rhyme, there's a rhyme.